Hi everyone, this is Shirley Hudson of Hudson Qualities, and this is my new book, Charming Dolls by c t Publishing. And it's a book all about creating easy, simple dolls, and it has a lot of detail and instructions to make your own dolls. Here's a little sample. Here's some dolls. Um, the details on how to make them. Detailed shots of um, how to do the eyes and everything you need to do to make your own doll. And come on over here, Selena. This is my daughter, Selena. <laughs> she did the detailed photo shots of the book and she created some dolls herself. So it's really a collaboration yeah. for both of us. And let me just show you some of the dolls, the actual dolls that we created. This one is the bunny doll. She's a little sweetie. The magic of her is the embellishments, I think, just adding the fun embellishments that you have in your craft room make all the difference. And you learn all the details of painting. This isn't really hard at all. It's really simple, simple circles, simple shading with colored pencils. All the details are in the book. And this one is Sparkles, the snowman. She's really easy because she really just has twig arms. She doesn't even have arms and legs. And then there's Dracula with his cape. He's real cute and very blue. He wouldn't have to make him so blue, but I thought he needs to be blue this time. And I got an Americana doll. She's sewn up with lots of um, tool that's just tied in a knot and glued. Here is a pilgrim. She got herself a little turkey. And these dolls are really simple to make. They're just simple sewing back and forth, back and forth, all the way around and stuffing. Very simple. Here's a kitty. And this one just has a little tail glued to the back. Um, and I encourage you to make your own shapes and dolls. Uh, there's lots of patterns in the book, but you certainly can make your own designs with your own ideas. And uh, right here is an angel, this little girl. She's sort of simply dressed because I wanted her to be able to hold all these accessories, like a rainbow, the sun, Here's a Christmas tree. So if she was just sitting in her little doll chair, she could be holding all these different celebratory designs in her lap like that. So she's kind of cute. She can, and you can make these into ornaments too, but all the pattern designs are in the book. And she can hold all these cute little characters. So that's in the book. And some other designs that you can make are, here's the creature of the Black Lagoon. His fabric really makes him kind of swampy looking with lots of fringy yarn. Very simple. Here is Frankenstein. And he was the sweetheart. I added just a crochet bow and some dollar store uh, eyeballs. And this is just cardboard with a lightning bolt. And here's his woman, the bride. Frankenstein. She's just really a simple gathered up gauzy piece of fabric. And I just got my ephemera together and made herself a sign. And here's Wolfie, the wolf, wolfman werewolf. And he's got a swing, swinging 60s pants. And uh, he's one of my favorites. And here's a spooky doll, a uh, pumpkin doll. You don't have to make him spooky, but I just had to give him teeth because he's I wanted to make him a little bit more scary. And then this is my daughter's doll, kind of a kaiwaii little girl, kind of manga styled, pink hair, big eyes. Here's a vampire, really cool. I love his shading. And a lot of these dolls are using your imagination and kind of going with it. I just love this hatter, oops. He was holding a teacup. <laughs> And he's got a big frilly cravat, crazy great hair. Selena made this, my daughter. And here's my Beetlejuice, or like a zombie type character. 
a lot of stripes and crazy moss and she actually put cheesecloth that was dyed green. It's not really moss, but you could put moss on there. And here's a cute little deer. Something she just drew up and sewed. And then here's another cool pirate. You could add yarn to make sort of dreadlocks and cool little things hanging from his beard. <laughs> anyway, these are some of the designs that you can make using this, the charming dolls. And it's really fun. See you later.